Okay, um, welcome to this quick tutorial. Although this isn't technically about Dreamweaver, we're going to look at something that could actually help you uh, promote your website a little bit more with a free service called Facebook. Um, what we're looking at here is one, what's called a Facebook page, where you can um, kind of create your own little web page within Facebook book, and people can subscribe to it and become fans of it. So you're looking at two different little web pages within Facebook. And I'm going to just show you real quick how you would go about getting started in that. Okay, let me close those. And let's just go to Facebook here. And okay, so where you're going to go is, first of all, you need to create a Facebook account, and that is free. So you can just go to Facebook.com to create an account. But then, if you go to this link here that's being highlighted, go ahead and copy it down, you can create what is called a page. Now you'll get something really basic that's set up as a template, but what you can add to your Facebook page that will allow you to customize it, so I'm going to go down to one more page I have bookmarked here. And I'm just giving you these URLs because sometimes they can be a little difficult to find um, within Facebook. Once you create your page, go to this URL here. Go ahead and copy that all down. Actually, what I'll do here, I'll go ahead and copy it. I'll put it on a text for you. Or you can just go into um, Facebook and search static FBML in the search bar and you'll get this page up. Once you have this page up, what you can do is there will be an option for you once you're logged in and signed up, there will be an option that comes down here that says add this to my page. Once you add the static FBML box to your page, then you are able to go into that box and just copy and paste HTML into that box and then you can have your custom images and your custom links right in Facebook. This isn't an in-depth tutorial. This is just a couple tips to get you started to create a web page in Facebook. People then can subscribe as a fan to your page, and you can gain some popularity and link to your main website from Facebook. That's going to be it for this quick tip. Um, you can go to my website at www.kperspectives.com and get more tips and information on website development. Thank you very much.